Right now, airports on a high alert as a deadly virus spreads from China to the U.S. Officials are screening passengers for coronavirus at five U.S. airports. At least three of those airports have connecting flights to Charlotte. Wake up, Charlotte's Richard Devane now live at Charlotte Douglas with the very latest. Richard, so far, only one case has actually been confirmed here in the U.S. Yeah, but health officials are looking at that particular person to see the people that he might have come into contact with. That's a 30-year-old man who is now in isolation as they worry about this uh, virus. Now, we can tell you that, as you said, there are a number of airlines that will come into here. We can say in Los Angeles as well as New York. Those are some of the places where these screenings are taking effect. All of this in an effort to stop this virus from spreading. We know that coronaviruses can be serious. United States health officials say they're taking steps to try to prevent the spread of the coronavirus. The mysterious pneumonia-like illness has killed at least six people and sickened hundreds in Asia. Now the first case reported in the U.S. in Washington state. Symptoms of the coronavirus are similar to the more common infectious diseases we see here in America. Which presents a challenge to doctors trying to sort out the difference between a coronavirus infection and, for example, flu. Screenings now taking place at five airports that have flights coming from China. We're taking these steps because the situation is evolving so rapidly. Yeah, just for perspective, this 30 days ago was the first time that someone uh, was, was uh, diagnosed with this uh, virus. We can tell you that the CDC says expect cases, more confirmed cases here in the U.S. And they say the best way to, to ward off this virus or to fight it is continuous hand washing and trying to not put your hands near your mouth and uh, be very careful as you come into contact with any substance, hand washing, Carrying hand sanitizer is probably the best bet. We're at Charlotte Douglas, Richard Avane for Wake Up Charlotte.